Taiwanese would be very good at the state fair. You go to a place that doesn't have a line, so then you can go to one that does have a line. And eat your food. Pizza on a stick. This is called pizza too. Yep, pizza on a stick. Oh, it looks just like bread. 18, 18 long hot dog. Yeah, so channel is about fun culture and language differences that we experience every day in our marriage. Minnesota State Fair. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna eat lots of food, maybe go on some rides, see some farm animals, and I don't know what else. It's been ages since I've been here. Like I was a teenager last time I came. Really? So probably. Wow. Probably. How that? This is my first time. Minnesota State Fair 2024, the last day of the fair. What a beautiful day for it. We picked a good timing, yes. good primary. Yes. So we hopped on the bus to come over here and that was super convenient. Yeah. Like we got in and out in less than five minutes. Found a parking spot, hopped on the bus, and we were on the way. So like a tons of people, but you don't feel crowded. Right. That's just something I noticed because even in Taiwan, you go anywhere, that many people, you always pushing people and yeah. crowded. Yeah, yeah. That is blow my mind. Thank you. It's like when we get back on the bus. I remember. Oh, we are here. Wow, it's so big. Oh, <laughs> wow. Look that. Yep, a ride. So many people. Wow. Don't get any so many people. <laughs> oh my gosh. We need to wait in line. We're waiting here. Hello. Two adults, please. Thank you very much. Oh, is it like a $18 per person? What does the ticket look like? Just like this. The ticket is like this. It's just like a bank account. Can you buy the ticket? It's just the ticket in. So you want to do everything, it's not included. It depends, yes. So the ticket just gets you in here. Oh. And then there are a lot of things for free. Okay. But most of the rides, for example, and of course the food, you have to pay for all of that. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, so it's divided into different sections in different areas, uh -huh. kind of like a night market. You'll uh -huh. have your, your food section and then your ride slash game section. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But I just, I can't remember what's where, so we'll figure it out. Wow. <laughs> so first impressions, honey? Uh, it's like a night market feeling. And there's like a museum park. Amusement so park. amusement park. Yeah. See like all the hot dog, everything. Long dog on the stick. It sounds sexual. Eight, 18 dollars. <laughs> 18 inch long dog on the stick. Huh? <laughs> Oh no, it's happening again. So this is a corn dog. Eighteen inch hot dog. Okay, okay. Eighteen, eighteen long hot dog. Oh man. Uh, so there's another place called the Pronto Dog. That's what I want to get because the batter, like the corn that they dip the actual hot dog in, is uh, it's different and it, feel, it just feels a little better. It feels a little cleaner, but that place looks cool. Pizza on a stick. So that's what, this place is kind of famous for putting everything on a stick. Or is it kind of like a Taiwan, right? Like yeah. 
put stuff on the stick. Yeah. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. What do you what kind of pizza do you have on the stick? Is it cheese and pepperoni? But we also have some calzone sausage and pepperoni. Okay. So you could just get a cheese. You just want to get a cheese one? Okay. Right. Vegetarian. Cheese? Yeah, just the cheese. There's no meat in that, right? No, it's just the. Uh... Oh. Thank you. Here, it's a little dripping. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Ah, like this. Okay. <laughs> that is so big. All right. It's not 18 inches, but it's a pizza on a stick. This is called pizza too. Yep. Pizza on a stick. Oh, it looks just like bread yeah. and tomato sauce. I think it's gonna have hot cheese on the inside, so. Like a Domino pizza. Domino. 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 Domino pizza. Okay. It's just cheesy pizza. Cheese. Keep walking. I never have the pizza like this before. Yeah. So this is like traditional style pizza? Well, the State Fair is famous for just putting everything on a stick. So pizza on a stick, you got all these desserts on a stick, of course hot dog on a stick. Oh, here's the pronto puff. Oh, alright, here's the, here's the corn dog that I want to get. And of course there's a line. Look, it's like Taiwan! Yeah, like Taiwan. All right, here is the Pronto Dog, the original Pronto Pup, sorry. And here's the Pai Kui. So I feel like Taiwanese would be very good at the State Fair. As you know, you get your food, you get, you go to a place that doesn't have a line, so then you can go to one that does have a line. Oh, um, just catch up. Thank you. Let's do it. Thanks. Yep, I just wanted this one. Ah, the two sides. You don't like the bigger one. I want to be able to try a bunch of stuff today. So. Oh. Got bees, so we're gonna walk. Walk and eat. All right, so in probably 20 years. So 20 years. Probably. Doesn't look like anything special. Just looks like a corn dog, right? Uh -huh. But. <laughs> oh. I don't know how to describe it. It just feels lighter and cleaner than a regular corn dog. Really? Yep. Um, oh. It's so good. You're missing out, honey. I don't think I ever ever seen you eat hot dog in Taiwan. You don't? Uh. No. Advertisement for this company. All right, to the horses. Small one. I never see that many horses in one location. That smells so strong. It smells like a farm. It smells like a farm. <laughs> it smells like a farm. <laughs> it smells like shithole. This 
horse's name is Stripper. <laughs> Stripper. <laughs> Hi, Stripper. Stripper. Stripper won an award. Hey, buddy. Good stripper. Hi, stripper. Oh, uh, Smokey. Do not touch, do not feed. All right, you Smokey. Are you tired, buddy? Smokey looks tired. How are sleeping? Standing, sleeping? No, I think they lay down. Lay down? Yeah. Oh. So. There's one that's got a lot of awards. Win so many. Oh, bugs. Wow. Eighth place. Eighth place. Fifth place. First place. Fifth place. Third place. Bugs. How big this size? Like when we went to hold it's only like yeah. three or four horses. This is like ten holies. Yes. And by the way, the holy farm uh, the holy horse ranch is closed. I think then shut down. Oh really? Forever, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Good boy, Frank. Yeah. So do you use do you use a product on it when you wash it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Very cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Really cold, then we'll lie down sleep. Oh. So they sleep different like a dog. Oh, okay. So then do then do standing sleeping. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That guy's huge. <laughs> Farm kids have to come here work and so boring. Like everybody faces kind of in Taiwan, parents force the kids to do the restaurant job, like working. The cows look different than Taiwan. So some of these cows are like. Some of them are milk cows, some of them are... Yeah, uh, look. Different, different Is this the closest you've ever been to a cow? Yeah. Yeah. 
So throughout all of Minnesota, this might be one of the bigger events. So if you brought your cattle here and you win, I think it's a pretty big deal. But, and I'll notice here they say where they're from. So lots of farm towns around all of rural Minnesota. What, what just happened? What? What? The just in the coming out. <laughs> Welcome to the farm. Oh wow, and that's like a big stadium. Ooh. See the uh, state fair police. Ooh. Animal competition. Animal competition, specifically horses. Uh, probably not horses anymore. No, I think it's horse racing. Still horse? I think so. But then they're doing different types of competitions. Like, one of them is a barrel competition, and then I know there, there are some other ones too. Maybe jumping? I'm not sure. The guy riding the horse, he want to control the boat, go back. Yep, exactly. But this that's, his, uh, that's his job. Cowboy. Yep, exactly. But who is the one drive the the bull? So that's a bull rider. Oh, uh, so that's a cowboy job to train the animal go back. Yep. So he do the choo choo choo. Yep. But the cow, the boat, and the horse. Who's more powerful? The bull's probably more powerful, but the man and the horse are smarter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Original mini apple pie. Creative container gardening. All about gardening and stuff. They should have, yeah. Should.
Well, everybody want to take a picture with fake Sakura. It's as close as we get to the real thing. <laughs> Never seen real Sakura? Yeah. I mean, there are parts of the U.S. that has them, that have real Sakuras, but in Minnesota, not so much. We don't get Sakuras here. We don't get Sakuras in Minnesota. I think out on the East Coast, I remember there's some story about, like, the president of the U.S. and the president of Japan had some relationship. I'll have to look it up, but I forget which president it was. But the president of Japan donated like a thousand Sakuras to the U.S. and they planted them uh, near Georgetown along the river there. And so whatever season that they blossom, it's a beautiful place. I've been there before. I've been lucky enough to be there. It's really cool. Represent China. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing? Can I get one of the Arnold Palmer fucking sure. Is that coming in a bottle or is it like... It's in a can, can we pour it in the cup. Oh, that's perfect. Perfect. We got a little uh, Arnold Palmer hard seltzer here. What is so, that? Do you know what an Arnold Palmer is? An Arnold Palmer, he's a famous golfer. Uh, and he coined this drink that is like half lemonade, half iced tea. Oh! But this has alcohol in it. Oh. So it's like half lemonade, half iced tea, and then probably vodka or something like that. Oh, that tastes like juice. It tastes oh. like apple juice. You wanna try it? Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Right? Yeah, like juice. It's refreshing. Let's see what they got for magnets over here. Just like ours. Yeah. The one we gave Eden. Throw the ball. Exactly. It's Labor Day. Labor Day weekend usually marks the end of summer. Yeah. I mean, we'll still have nice weather, but it's like everyone goes back to school after this, and it's the last day of the state fair. So it is. It's kind of like an annual tradition is marking the end of Minnesota summer. Yeah. Oh, now we need to wait in line. After you. Thank you, sir. Yes. Oh. You too. Bye. <laughs> Do not swing or fall asleep. Oh. 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 my God. Oh. I cannot look. Oh. My God. We're above the fair, honey! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. 
it's nice and smooth. Okay. Just look at the people. Enjoy the people. Oh, there's the Ferris wheel. So that's the direction you want to go. Let's see the Ferris wheel over there. Look at all the people. It's like Taiwan down there. <laughs> Such a cool view. Hey. See grandstand show. No, oh, the grandstand is in there. So that's probably where the big concert is. Yeah, and I know like every night there's a like a big major concert. Wow, look at the slide! Oh, wow. You just go on like a little mat, almost like a piece of carpet. Mm -hmm. And then it's just uh, like plastic. Mm -hmm. right now. Ah. I've seen some things on like Instagram, where slides like that that just go too fast. People just end up flying over the bumps. Oh, yeah. <laughs> kind of like what you do that in the water, right? Yeah. You sit on the water and you jump. Yeah. Oh, what a nice. Actually, it's really huge. We're not even go those parts. Oh. That's it. Honey, we found the Amish donuts. We found the Amish donuts. We took a four and a half minute gondola ride, probably a 10 minute walk to get to the donuts. These are it. Oh, the line's not that bad. Or wait, that's the line. Okay, never mind. Yep, the line's bad. The line's bad. The pie doy. Pie. Oh my god. This might. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> No way. Okay. Is that for real? No, you can't. Okay. Me. There is the donut shop. And this is the line, 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 line. It does. It's wrapping around here. Oh my. Oh my. No. Look at that, honey. No. No. Wait, wait, wait. wait. This is Taiwan, right? Taiwan runs for no? Too long? The line is still going. We saw the donut shop way back there. It's still going. This has got to be, I don't know, 600 people? More? Okay, I finally see the spot. Okay, this is the end. This is the end, okay. We're gonna call Lily, my cousin, who was here yesterday, and we're gonna ask her how long the line was when she was here. This line is uh, I ever ever seen that in Taiwan that's such a long line like this. Never. This is ridiculous. So we chose not to do the Amish donuts. We're doing mini donut factory. All right. How you doing? Good. I think I'm just gonna do one mini donut, one bag of mini donuts. Yeah. It's really cool. In Taiwan, you use hand. Here, you use machine. Donuts. It's not the Amish donut, but it is the original mini donut. Oh, really? Original? That's what they say. Tom Thumb Donuts. The original mini donut. So, it's just a small donut dipped in sugar.
It's kind of like a Taiwan one, but softer. But the texture is different. Yeah, right? texture yeah. different. Yeah. Taiwan is a little bit like the skin. It's so soft. Oh, it's so good. How was your first ever experience at the Minnesota State Fair, honey? Oh, wow. It's uh, pretty crazy. Like, it feels so fun, actually. Yeah. Like a lively feeling. Yeah. Kind of this thing, you always see that in Asia, but but now, like in states, half a year, finally, first time you see this, it's really cool. Everybody have to come. <laughs> quite, quite incredible. Yeah. How would you describe the vibe here? Like you said, it's energetic. Like, yeah. Is there anything you can compare it to in Taiwan? Oh, I would think just night market. Okay, but I mean, it's not. That doesn't do it justice, right? It's not just a night market. Yeah, night market and amusement park. It, yeah. It's got rides. Uh, like brands and stores have booths here. There's Jeep, I see there's Dodge, like there's Ford, uh, Chevy, all of the car companies have, mm -hmm. you know, their cars here. There's a Ferris wheel, there's a, uh, I mean, it's, it's crazy. See families, young, old, all kinds of people, all types of people. It is truly like a, a melting pot of the Midwest that mm -hmm. comes here. Mm -hmm. And the nickname for it is the Great Minnesota Get Together, called the Minnesota State Fair, the Great Minnesota Get Together. So it just means, you know, it's an excuse for everyone to get together, hang out. And I think that kind of sums it up. Well, I hope you enjoy it. Remember, no try, no no. no. no.